So you talk about the idea of the bad day, the worst of days. Phil, in your book, available in all good bookstores, Death from the Skies, uh, chapter one, verse one, it is, you know, what happens when an asteroid hits. Uh, paint us all a picture. Let's say, you know, they can't solve this problem. What's that going to be like? Is the chapter called Duck and Cover? Um, <laughs> uh, what was the chapter? I, I literally wrote a book called Death from the Skies, <laughs> and the yeah, first chapter the was Asteroid Impacts, yep. and I can't remember what the uh, first chapter was, because I wrote it like 10 years ago. Um, uh, it would be a very bad day. Um, in, in Salvation, and I, have, I, I keep asking you this, it's seven miles across. Is this correct, or is it no. seven... Kilometers yeah, across. Yeah, it's okay. a big one. No, much smaller, uh, seven kilometers. We because really we, shouldn't mess up yeah. imperial and metric units. I, we have, I know. We, have, it's, we have previous rounds. It's here. a good way to, to bomb Mars with a probe, actually, is to get those two things mixed up. Um, and a few laughs from the audience. Okay, good. Um, and, and it's funny, it's funny. It doesn't matter if the asteroid is seven kilometers or seven miles across. Either way, you're, you're facing a global catastrophe. Um, this thing would pass through the atmosphere in a few seconds. It would be moving it. 20 kilometers per second, maybe 40, depending on, on the orbit. Um, it'll pass through extremely quickly. It'll be a, a tremendously bright flash. Something that big will pass through the atmosphere like it doesn't even exist. Slam into the ground or the ocean. Uh, either one is bad. Uh, it, 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 it almost doesn't matter how fast it's moving, how big it is at, at this size. It's, just, it's a global catastrophe no matter what. Um, the fireball would be essentially like igniting every nuclear weapon on the planet um, several hundred times over, maybe several thousand times over, uh, possibly more depending on how big the asteroid is, all at once, all in one spot. The fireball would be visible um, as far away as uh, the horizon and even past it because it would light up the air. There would be a shock wave that would move out through the air and through the ground. Um, if, if you weren't incinerated by the fireball, uh, the earthquake and the shock wave would turn you into cottage cheese. Um, <laughs> the amount of material thrown up into the atmosphere Bad. could cause a, an extinction level event all over the planet. You'd have ejecta, stuff, huge boulders thrown out that would then go on ballistic arcs, arcs over out of the atmosphere and back in. So that there'd be like secondary impacts from this. Um, uh, so Yay. far, none of this so, sounds good. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, so sleep tight. <laughs>